Our superintendent was notified today about 11 o'clock and we have a crisis team that's already in place and we immediately got together and started the process. A parent advisory was written and sent home with all the students. This was actually an early release day for our students. So our students were already scheduled to be dismissed at 1230 today. So a parent advisory went home today at 1230 with those students and also an out dial is in process and that's a system where we call all the families, um, all the households that attend that school and give them the information as well. Also, we are sending information home with every family that is involved in our child care program and an attempt is going on to contact all the children that attend the City of Phoenix PAC program and that's all in process when we left the district a few hours ago. So that's all in process now. Um, additionally, an advisory went home on Monday when um, with, with students district-wide that just spoke to um, symptomology of this and what things to look for in their children and the things like hand washing and covering coughs and that was just that was before we knew we had a student in the school district it was um, just for information for our parents and so we were already in process of trying to get information out there to our students within our school district. You said that was before you knew that you had anybody confirmed or before you knew Before we knew we had anybody confirmed sent. on Monday of you know this week we no we did not know a sample had been sent we were just trying to be proactive and make sure that our parents were aware of the symptoms that we wanted them to watch for and when to keep their children home and what things they could do um, within their home to um, like hand washing and the covering of coughs and that sort of thing so we had done that on Monday district-wide and of course this parent advisory to close uh, to dismiss the students today was just in the one school uh, in Moon Mountain not above average. It's it's still flu season, so we're not seeing anything above average.